Hello. Okay, so I was going to give you some ideas of how to charge the um, Biao Fang UV 5R. I'm sorry about my pronunciation. Pronunciation. Uh, UV 5R on the go without any electricity, basically. So whether out camping, hiking, whatever you're doing, I'm going to give you some ideas how to charge one of these. <laughs> so you can charge it by 12 volt, obviously. Um, you can get adapters for the car. Um, so normal desktop charger come with a radio and I've purchased one of these cables um, so it's a USB so some sort of adapter in there to change the voltage from um, input 10 volts obviously USB is 5 volts but it works so uh, I've got one of these battery packs and when you plug it in it should light up see the little green light I'll just show you again so we're now able with a USB battery pack to charge and they go red when I drop them in to charge the radio so that's one way of charging on the go um, obviously you need to charge these uh, if you're out for too long that's going to run out, that's going to run out. You could get more battery packs. Another option is another battery pack with a solar panel. But um, the solar panel on these are very poor, I would say. You know, you need a good few days sunshine to, to get this up to a decent level. Um, so I don't really recommend those. They're okay as a battery pack, but the solar panel's not very good at all. However... One of these folding solar panels. Um, this one's a 20, 20 volt one. Sorry, 20 watt one. Uh, again, there's USB ports inside there. So that, with enough, well, with, with hardly any actually sunlight on it, you can plug the cable into the USB port on there. And that will also charge a radio. Or you can charge a battery pack then charge a radio. Uh, another option is a little two AA USB pack. Um, obviously you can take a few more AAs. You can get AAs quite easily anywhere. Um, they will so again watch for the green light. Um, That one does work, honest. It worked earlier. I think I've got the battery in the wrong way. Come to think about it, because it fell out just now. Dun, 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 dun. Dun, dun, dun. Dun, dun, dun. There we go. Sorry, I had the battery in the wrong way. So we've got the green light. So uh, AA batteries. Now, another way I was thinking is I purchased a couple of these little garden lights I think they're gutter, gutter lights something like that wall lights um, so the solar panel charges a rechargeable AA now the ones that it actually comes with is a thousand milliamp which is, is okay you could obviously put a, a bigger uh, capacity battery in and then take this battery out you need a couple of these take this two of those out and pop them in there to charge your radio um, I will let you know how long it takes to charge off the battery pack of the basically the uh, USB because it's only half the voltage I'm imagining it's going to take twice as long but I don't know I'll let you know on the comments below um, I will also let you know how much radio standby time I can get out a day's out of a day's worth of charging off two AAs. Okay, so I'll charge two AAs that are down, that are run out. I'll charge them for a day in the sunlight or, or UK 
winterish daylight should I say um, so obviously not going to be much but about eight hours of just about daylight um, I'll let you know how much radio time you can get out of one day's charge off of a couple of those okay um, I suppose I could also in the comments below let you know how much time a daylight's worth of charging off of that will be okay I think that's it for now um, I'll put some more comments below over the next few days and I'll let you know thanks very much bye bye